So, see right now, yeah, like I get florals, baby ass. Like, <laughs> Alright guys, so thank y'all for tuning in today. It's your girl Stylist Raven and I know it's a fragrance Monday, but I do have some other stuff that I want to throw in here that I got from Sephora and the stuff that I got from Victoria's Secrets. It's no longer in the bag, but that's okay because guess what, honey? She got receipts and because she has receipts, I get to tell y'all like what was in there and I could just insert pictures and clips and all that because the kids are already using that. So since it's fragrance monday let me tell y'all what my favorite newest fragrance is right now and it would be this and i got it in like a um a sample so this is by hermes and i think it's called twilly um the hermes and as y'all can see i use this i'm gonna find this in the bottle y'all already know that i'm gonna post the notes up here in the video so y'all can see okay your girl never lets you down um so y'all can see but y'all i have this on right now and god this shit smells so good like and I, I think I would have to rate this with my Dylan Blue. That's that's where I'm at on it. That's that's what she's giving. That's what she's giving. That's what she's giving. I would have to rate this with my Dylan Blue. All right. So very firstly, um, Victoria's Secrets Bed Bath. Um, I mean, yeah, Bath and Body Works and Sephora. Those were all actually Valentine's Day gifts and I was supposed to do this and show it to y'all and everything like that and life fucking happened. So, um, just to show y'all like what was in here, okay, I will go down to the receipt. So for Victoria's Secrets boo, this is what I got. Um, I love their little wash sets. So I got the Coconut Milk Rose. Um, it was the set. I got the pomegranate lotus set. I got the cucumber green tea set. And they basically came with the body scrub. And I want to say a mist. I want to say it was three to it. Yeah, it was two jars and a mist. So it's, it's a set of three. I really can't remember. It's probably on the, on the website. Um, but yeah, those are what I got the girls out of there. And I absolutely love them. One of them was a lavender and something. I think it was like lavender and I can't remember because they had bought it for me. And that's what actually drove me to Victoria's Secrets because I rarely ever go in Victoria's Secrets anymore for scents and things like that. Um, but when the girls bought me that and I absolutely loved it, I think it was like peony and lavender. Um, I went in looking for that to get them each like their own set for V-Day. So they love it. They're already using it. Keeps the skin. It exfoliates the skin. It's really smooth. I like it. Um, and it's actually affordable. If you buy it in the set, I think they're all like $9.98, something like that. Overall, for me to get the three sets, I spent $86.38. $86 so that's not bad at all. And we're going to move along and go into... Sephora. So I only have two of the items in here right now because most of them I have taken out. Um, so I went in there and I went and I got some more of my Fenty Skin Instant um, Gel, you know, like for under the eyes. I got some more of the Fenty Skin Cleanser and I got those two were for me and I got them each a Fenty Gloss Balm Heat. So I got Fenty Heat Glow, Gloss Balm and Fussy, um, Sweet Something, Sweet Mouth, I guess. And that was for each of them and that went in there like Valentine's Day um, gift bags. And then for myself, I got the, a Gabe because when I used to work at, at Sephora, I loved it. So I went and I finally got some more of it. I got the nighttime um, lip therapy and I got the weekly lip, lip scrub. So those were my things that are outside of fragrances that I would definitely say is something you should get. All in all, in Sephora that day, I spent $195.93. Um, and of course, I had my Beauty Insider and all of that good stuff. So I used all of that good stuff. So that's what I got there. So now to jump into these fragrances. As y'all can see, I went into Macy's. And my girl always hooks me up when I go into Macy's. I left with two nice little baggies. 
Um, and actually, I got a polo bag and I gave that to the boo. So he's already using that. Um, and I gave that to him as a gift. I also got a Michael Kors bag, which came with some of my stuff. So I can't wait to either um, put stuff, hair accessories or makeup or whatever for, you know, or even just use it as like a overnight bag or whatever, you know, maybe me and him might go somewhere, do something strange for a little change and I might need an overnight bag. <laughs> no, I'm playing, but I'm not though. So, um, outside of the two bags, um, I also got this pouch and I'm going to get into these fragrances, y'all don't worry. But I just want to show y'all how they always, always, always take care of me because every time I go in, I'm spending. So I got a lot of samples this particular time. Um, I mean, literally, every time I go buy my fragrances, I'm spending. So this time wasn't that bad. I spent $3.96. Okay. Receipts, honey. Um, so one of the samples I got was the Ralph Lauren Beyond Romance. And I gave that to one of my daughters. I do not remember what this one was. It was one that I was like on the edge about. It's got a real fresh smell to it. And so they put in a sample, but they didn't label it. So that's the only thing about that because it sucks because now I have no clue what it is to know if I want to go. Damn, that smells good. Know if I want to go and purchase it again, right? Um, but here's another little pouch that was in there. And it was created by Macy's. And I just got this because they were like, you always come in. You're always buying fragrances. Here, girl, we're going to give you these. And most of the stuff that was in here, I've already dispersed between the kids and stuff. But I have a Laura Mercier lipstick, which I thought that was cute. It's a red. I need to put that now that I've, I've done the um, video for y'all. I can go and put it in stuff. I got a Renewed Hope in a jar. It's something. I don't know what it is. Um... A Peter Thomas and Roth. See, most of this stuff I would think would have came from Sephora, but nope, this came from Macy's. A liquid glass dry bar, some samples. So it's all just samples. But how cute is the little pouch? It's just cute to stick toiletries in or, you know, something like that. Um, if you just need something small. So that, that was super cute. And my specialist that helped me, of course. She always put her name up in there. All right, so dang y'all, that Hermes, that is not even playing. I don't even want to spray anything else because it just smells so good. So, let me start with this one. I got this one, the Irresistible by Givenchy. Um, and it came with the lotion. It came with the perfume, because y'all know I, I'm solely all about a perfume. Um, and it came with a mini perfume. But, of course, she gave me another one just, just off. So this one, I'm going to put all the notes in because I cannot remember the notes off the top of my head. But I do know that it came, um, it does have sea salt in it. And I really like it. Um, I've already been using it. I just put it back in here for the purposes of the video. <laughs> so I don't know why I never really use my little hand lotions. But I do carry one in my purse and stuff like that just in case. So as y'all can see, I am using this one. Um, this one is just really... Oh God, it like, this is your spring and summer scent. It's light, it's not too heavy. Um, it's everything that I love. And like the sea salt is like the, the last thing that I actually smell in this. So this was definitely one that I was gonna get. I'm gonna take it all out the box now, throw the box away. Um, you get about, how many ounces? 2.5 fluid ounces on the lotion. And then of course, um, Oh my God, that smells so, so delicious. So delicious, delicious, delicious. But yes, so this is what I got um, from that one, from the Givenchy. Um, and I like, is that the one with the sea salt? It may not be, it might be the Michael. One of them has sea salt at the end. I, I don't know, when I look at the notes and I plug them in for y'all, we'll figure it out, okay? So, and then I got another little sample that she gave me because she was just like, girl, you spinning. So here you go. You always come in. You always, you know, I always take care of her. So she takes care of me because that commission baby ain't no joke. Okay. Um, toss that over there. So basically, I wind up getting two of these when I really only pay for one and the actual um, big bottle and then the lotion. That's what I got. So I like that. 
Um, I don't think that's the one with the sea salt. I'm not sure. Okay, well, then I got this. This is like my first Michael Kors um, perfume that I've ever pretty much even entertained. Um, and I really did like this one. This one is called Wonderlust. I really, really, really did like this one. I liked like wearing it around. Um, this is another one that I would say is definitely like fresh out the shower, fresh into spring, fresh into summer. These are this is that girl okay the the bottle itself is just absolutely gorgeous i love how it has like the ombre effect it's just so pretty um this is the one with the sea salt yes so the sea salt is at the end of this i yeah definitely this has to be the one with the sea salt definitely so i wonder what i was smelling on the other one i don't know but this one is very um they're both fresh, like really, really fresh. And that's what I went in this particular day. It's not that I don't have summer sp smells or spring, sp spring smells. Damn, I can't talk. Or spring smells. I just wanted something for 2022 because I had stuff for 2021, 2020. I needed some stuff for 2022, okay? You got to change it up sometimes because uh, my signature smell is definitely my, my Dylan Blue or my um, Vos Vita. Um, y'all know that for sure. Those are like, that's my signature. Any given day, you're going to smell, see me and smell me smell like one of those two. Okay. However, I wanted to change it up because you know, you don't always want to smell the same all the, all the time. So definitely this is, um, this is just a way for me to keep doing it. Cause typically I only do, I, I originally I started out with like, I just want to smell different every day, right? Every day of the week seven cents that's all i need but i'm a woman and i have the right to change my mind so therefore i have probably over a month's worth of scents and i'm okay with that <laughs> and nobody has no complaints from the kids to anybody else now this one here i can give y'all story time okay um in the store when I purchased this one, the Donna Karen Cashmere Mist, right? I sprayed it. I liked it. Um, I did, right? I really liked it. You had the choice. And it's the same thing. You either get this bottle or you get the clear bottle. And so I was just like, okay, well, give me the red bottle. It just looks different. It'll look good. Cute on the shelf. But it's the exact same scent. So she wound up giving me this one for free. Um, just a smaller one. So the the both sizes would be both bottles would look like this in this size um it's just one would be clear one would be red so she so she gave me both um she gave me like a little sample of this one just to have and i thought that was cute because if i'm traveling and i'm putting this one in my purse and i have it this is the issue i have with it when i got home and I started kind of like wearing it on me for like a longer term time. Um, I don't know. I just didn't. I I didn't like how it meshed on my skin. It started kind of giving me more of like a powdery smell, um, especially like as I would go out throughout the day. I started kind of getting like a, a powdery powdery smell. And then for whatever reason, I got that in my mental Rolodex. And when I would go to spray it. I automatically would smell the the powder smell um however and it kind of reminded me of my christian louboutin um perfumes um with that type of smell and those are some of my least used perfumes so i don't see myself really gravitating in um pulling this one up and it's not that it smells bad it's just i don't know in the store i, I didn't get that and i kept smelling kept smelling and kept wearing it and i loved it and then when i got home I didn't really care for it. Um, so I got one of the little sample packlets. It's like a little tie towelette as well. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and spray this one. Y'all got to forgive me for snot and snorting. My allergies are acting up. Um, so I just, like, I'll still wear it. Like, I still put it on and wear it and everything like that. It's just, I don't wear it, like, if I'm going out. It's <laughs> it's one of those, like, if I'm in the house and I know I'm going to be in the house for the day. Or if I know I got yard work for the day. Or, like, I'm being honest. I'm trying to tell y'all. Something like that. I'll spray this one because it gives me more of um, a really clean, powdery scent. And I don't necessarily like to smell powdery. Um, 
I like florals and I'm not saying that this is not florals because it is it's just for some reason it when I get to moving around it I get more of the powder so see right now yeah like I get florals baby ass like <laughs> know if y'all have this one let me know what y'all think because it's not horrible it smells gorgeous but I don't want to smell like like sexy baby ass I like I just I, I don't know y'all help me so I mean that's what I picked up for the months from February up until now like starting around Valentine's Day wait when did I go to Macy's um Yeah, February 7th. All of this together was $3.96. Exactly, right? And from February until now, I will tell you what I gravitate to the most in the order that I do it. One, two, three. Yard work, housework, stuff like that going out um anywhere this irresistible this is this is bomb um this wonderlust this is bomb either either one of these i'll spray on my skin and get in the bed and lay up under my man either one of these i'll put on and i'll go out for the day and people are like mm, you know like it's just it's just that type of life so y'all go ahead and thumbs up this video if y'all have any questions if y'all like the baby ass y'all let me know if y'all have that one or if y'all know what I'm talking about, just let me know. Because I'm putting all the notes in there for y'all, okay? Um, and I think, yeah, girl, that's everything. Bye. And one more thing, y'all, that I almost forgot. Y'all thought the video was over, huh? Okay. So, I already had, um, because I told y'all, when I go to Victoria's Secrets, it's, I, I'll get like a, um, perfume or perfume can't remember if this one was a perfume or a perfume whatever but I got this one about a cup of maybe a year or so ago um this is the bombshell seduction so my kids they were looking for something because I love peonies I love lilies I love um I like those type of scents right uh, I'm not really big on roses and stuff like that so for Valentine's because it wasn't just me getting them stuff they got me something too so for Valentine's they got me the Victoria's Secrets bombshell and I actually love this one and, and this is the intense so it's definitely this one is more they're both seductive but in a different way this would be like Janet and this would be Miss Janet if you're nasty you know <laughs> It is that type of vibe like this one is which y'all probably know because y'all probably didn't smell this one before oh yeah this one is sexy and fresh I just feel like you know like um cute seduction like where you look him in the eyes and you're like like that right but then this one the intense hold on I gotta let her maybe I gotta let her do her magic because she's baby she didn't oh she got me all warm and stuff. Woo! Woo, child. Woo, Lord. She done seduced me, baby. Yeah. Woo! Shit. Okay. So this is the intense. <laughs> y'all. Woo! Wait, did I just hit my head? Okay, y'all. Ooh. Woo, baby. This one keep telling y'all I want the Rihanna's Rihanna's perfume right because it's got magnolias and everything in it that I would just absolutely love and magnolia is my favorite flower so I know hands down I'm gonna love it but this right here the intense this makes me this feels like fishnet stockings and a, a Louboutin pump baby with nothing else on topless no, nothing else on nothing else that's the seduction tie yourself in a damn red bow and come to him or her whatever your, your pleasure and that's what it is oh my god now, I told y'all I got on Hermes today Woo! 
Ooh, this one is a perfume. So I'm going to I'm going to say safely that this one is too. So yeah. If y'all don't have them, go get them cuz you're sleeping. You praying for your boy ass, but he right here in this bottle, baby. Okay? <laughs> Ow. Hey Gems, it's your girl Stylish Raven here. Thanks for watching my video today. Make sure you check out my previous video and most importantly, do not forget to subscribe, okay? If you're new to my channel, become fam, click subscribe, and follow me on my social networks. Bye!